What's up guys? How's it going? Welcome to the show. We got a uh, bunch of news and uh, we got 10 minutes to do it. So let's go ahead and hit it up right now. All right. First flux comes out for the uh, stability AI. It's an open source model uh, flux, the largest state of the art open source text to image model to date developed by F black forest labs the original team behind state of di stable diffusion is now available on foul uh, flux pushes the boundaries of creativity and performance with an impressive 12 billion parameters delivering the aesthetics of reminiscent mid journey so you guys can actually go and use this right now but some of the key features are enhanced image quality advanced human anatomy and photorealism improved prompt adherence and exceptional speed if you guys want to use it i'll link it down below and uh, you guys can use it there bmw is coming out with a robot here in the next four days pretty crazy stuff uh humanoid robot is what it says uh, hopefully it's not a vacuum or something, but look at that. I, I can't wait. Four more days. Figure two. Hopefully it's not like my robot that uh, just is a vacuum that rolls around on the floor that gets stuck on literally everything to the point where I just shut it off and uh, vacuum myself. Meta has came out with Sam 2, the next generation of Meta segment anything model for videos and images. This is pretty crazy. If you've used any type of photo editing or video editing, getting this and doing all of this stuff takes a long time. You gotta go frame by frame sometimes. If you're just getting her arm or you're getting this dough, you'd have to go frame by frame it looks like meta has came out with this uh sam 2 that allows you to just uh, click it and it does a pretty good job uh, adobe uh premiere pro or uh, uh after effects is not this good uh, i've i've done it a few times here's just an example uh the girl what is her name simon biles or something uh look at that they uh used this sam 2 to do that and it i mean up in the air even up in the air look at this Look at that. Perfect. So that's awesome. Big news for all of the uh, people working in fast food. <laughs> You're probably going to be wrecked and uh, looking for a new job soon. Unfortunately, I think this is kind of, uh, you know, just the way things are going. Not that I want it to happen. It looks like AI is going to be coming to Taco Bell uh, very soon. It's form of AI that will mimic human speech in the drive through experience. AI technology across hundreds of U.S. Taco Bell locations by the end of 2024. So, I mean, what? We're in August right now and, uh, you know, four months with hopes of using the tech to and their other brands, KFC and Habit Burger and globally in the future. AI that gives a voice to predictive technology with speech recognition and natural language processing will roll out in 13 states to enhance back of house operations for team members and elevate the order experience for customers. Uh, this is, uh, you know, unfortunate for anybody. And this is exactly what we all thought was going to happen when, when once they're paying people, fast food workers, $20 an hour. Of course, this is what's going to happen. And nobody, I can't, I, have you went to the drive through recently with an, with a family of, a, of four or five people? It's over a hundred dollars. Uh, right. So, uh, I think that this is a way that they can lower the prices. Uh, unfortunately it'll probably, uh, a lot of people are about to lose their jobs on this. So with over two years of fine tuning and testing the drive through voice AI technology, we're confident in its effectiveness in optimizing operations, enhancing customer satisfaction. So, uh, what do you guys think? Leonardo's getting acquired by Canva. Uh, it looks like Canva plans to add Leonardo's technology to its platform with Phoenix foundational model to be set or added to Canva's AI image and video generator. Uh, Leonardo will continue to operate independently and build on its existing products. And Phoenix also boasts the ability to generate clear and accurate text within images, something existing models struggle with. So I think that's pretty cool. And, uh, you know, 170 million people, it says here, uh, use Canva. So I don't ever use it. My kids use it. All right. Mid journey V 6.1 was just released. And uh, here's a bunch of stuff that's new, more coherent images, much better image quality, more precise and detailed, correct, small image features, uh, a new 2X upscaler with much better image slash texture quality, roughly 25% faster, uh, improved text accuracy, a new personalization model with improved nuance, 
uh personalization code a new dash dash q space two mode which takes 25 percent longer sometimes adds more texture at the cost of redu reduced image coherence and things just look generally more beautiful across the board it looks like v2 will come out in the next month though so uh they just need some more data on this 6.1 so that's pretty cool they're still uh updating this i i you know it's been i don't know how long six was out before uh 6.1 is but i'm glad we're getting updates all right gpt 40 long output has uh just been announced it's in the alpha program uh it has a maximum of 64,000 output tokens per request and we hope the experiment helps you explore new case use cases that are unlocked by longer completions i'm not a participant so i wouldn't know but alpha participants can access gpt 40 long output by using the this uh this code right here so uh, just to let you know, and uh, 64,000. So a million million tokens right now for input is $6 and a million output is $18 for this long output. All right, ChatGPT Advanced Voice has just been released. Everybody's been waiting for this. I wasn't privy to get one of the advanced uh, parties to get it, uh, but uh, some people have, and this guy, uh, it, it's pretty funny stuff. They've had it, uh, it looks like voice inflections are way better than it used to be uh they they have some of the voices doing bird calls and uh this guy has it doing a soccer commentator uh but he's just making coffee so it's it's announcing how i mean we can look at it super excited sports commentator uh, but instead of it being a soccer match it's just me making coffee and i want you to be so excited that you cannot help but scream and be super animated Brewing masterclass. The beans are ground. The water is heated. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. The pour begins. A steady stream of potential and flavor cascading into the vessel. Look at that focus. <laughs> so there you go. That's something that you can uh, play around with when that once it starts getting rolled out to you. I don't have it yet again, but uh, yeah pretty cool stuff i can't wait but that's all i got for you guys today hit the like hit the subscribe button comment down below and i will see you guys monday for your ai news take care everybody